four, data collection, process, and review of relevant information. The Office of the Assistant Secretary, Indian Affairs, oversees BIA, BIE, and BTFA. The BTFA provides fiduciary trust services for tribal and individual Indian beneficiaries that earn royalty, income, and other monies from activities on federally managed lands. The BTFA is also responsible for maintaining federal Indian records, including those at the AIRR. For the Federal Indian Boarding School Initiative investigation, BTFA established a project research team to review relevant records. The project research team included BTFA staff and volunteers from other department bureaus, including BIA, NPS, and BLM. The project research team process included identifying, screening, and preparing records from AIRR in Lenexa, Kansas, conducting initial and quality assurance reviews of the criteria research used to identify federal Indian boarding schools, generating federal Indian boarding school summaries from collected criteria data, and working with NABs under a Memorandum of Understanding to assist with criteria research used in the identification of federal Indian boarding schools. The department recognizes that the federal government and non-federal entities operated or supported Indian boarding schools. As the Federal Indian Boarding School Initiative is focused on Indian boarding schools that received federal oversight or support, the investigation examined records to develop the first official list of federal Indian boarding schools. The official list may change as the investigation continues to find additional records that detail the federal Indian boarding school system. Research Methodology and Scope of Review For the Federal Indian Boarding School Initiative, the department, through BTFA, is identifying and examining federal records in the Department of the Interior Library and AIRR. The AIRR includes retired Indian Affairs records from BIA agencies and BTFA offices across the nation. Records from as far back as the 1700s include trust, education, and other historic Indian affairs records. The American Indian Records Repository, AIRR. The AIRR is located in Lenexa, Kansas, which has 1.3 million cubic feet of underground storage space available for federal records. The AIRR is located 80 to 90 feet underground and stores records in National Archives and Records Administration archival quality storage bays that total approximately 350,000 cubic feet. The AIRR contains a total of over 200,000 indexed boxes of Indian Affairs records. Each standard records center box holds one cubic foot of material. One cubic foot holds approximately 2,500 sheets of paper. For the Federal Indian Boarding School Initiative, records review involves electronic screening of possible source boxes for any information about Federal Indian Boarding Schools within the AIRR. The research team applied pre-existing search processes and tools to initiate records research at AIRR. Specifically, the Box Index Search System was utilized for overall queries and refinement to identify records associated with federal Indian boarding schools. Investigation Research Process The general research process was as follows. A BISS query was completed to determine an initial, potentially responsive box list that included 39,385 boxes approximately 98,462,500 sheets of paper. Continuing investigation actions will include on-site digitization of boxes or targeted files in the potentially responsive boxes. Records will be stored in the department's Enterprise Records and Document Management System. When digitization is complete, remote review of the identified potentially responsive boxes will occur. As the first review from October 2021 involved keyword searches for known Indian boarding schools, a new search will be conducted following complete AIRR digitization of responsive boxes or files to identify any new federal Indian boarding schools. Examination of additional responsive boxes and files will continue and follow the same process. 
As AIRR digitization advances, BTFA research staff and department volunteer staff will continue to review records and classify the information about federal Indian boarding schools. With a focus on documents with responsive information about specific schools, attendees, attendee deaths, graves, and cemeteries. The BTFA is using an e-discovery program to search and tag all digitized documents. The research process will continue until all boxes identified as having information potentially relevant to federal Indian boarding schools are fully reviewed. The department is evaluating specific records for the Federal Indian Boarding School Initiative, including but not limited to the following. Department of War Annual Reports of the Commissioner of Indian Affairs. Department of the Interior Annual Reports. Department of the Interior Routes to Indian Agencies and Schools with their Post Office and Telegraphic Addresses and Nearest Railroad Station Reports. Department of the Interior Appropriations Documents. Department of the Interior National Park Services National Register of Historic Places School Identification, Location, and Historical Justification Information Department of the Interior Library Records for Initial Specific School Criteria Works Progress Administration, a New Deal Agency Reports and Report with respect to the House Resolution authorizing the Committee on Interior and Insular Affairs to conduct an investigation of the Bureau of Indian Affairs pursuant to House Resolution 689, 82nd Congress, December 15, 1952. Pursuant to its Memorandum of Understanding with NABS, the Department compared its Federal Indian Boarding School list and materials with a list independently established by NABS to seek official identification of schools in the Federal Indian Boarding School system. The BTFA research team and the NABS research team met weekly in working sessions to review and compare findings. Ongoing investigation actions will include collaborating with NARA to identify other available records, including their locations and potential resources required for future initiative stages. Identifying records covering specific federal Indian boarding schools and overall Indian boarding school system operation and law and policy framework. And reviewing department resources, authorities, and specific potential uses for specialized documents or information, including photographs, student roster lists, and total funding expended on federal Indian boarding schools, as well as creating maps and databases.